All right, hello and good morning. Um, welcome to this uh, week's edition of our, our web chat. Um, today was scheduled to be um, an overview of version 9.0 with Carl Lewis, but he has been called out of the office and he won't be able to do that. We're not going to cancel, we're just going to push back a couple of weeks and he'll do it when he returns. Um, so today we're going to do kind of a support uh, session uh, for general support calls towards the end, but the first thing I'm going to do is show you something that we've seen a lot recently, and that is a request to create a sandbox. Um, it's relatively easy. It's basically a copy of whatever database you choose, your live database or however you want to choose to do that. And you can refresh it periodically and use that database for testing. If you're going to be doing um, some DTW imports and you want to test them first to make sure they're right, um, you would use a sandbox. If you have an accounting situation that you're looking to see if uh, you can correct it with a certain document or something like that, then um, that's a good place to test it as a sandbox. Um, inventory adjustments you might want to make. There's a whole bunch of reasons to have one, and it's always a good thing. So let's get on to how to, how to do it. And where you can see the databases involved with your company um, are here. Um, and you can see I have quite a few. I have, I have some uh, customer databases that haven't been upgraded. I've, I have to submit things to SAP, so I have them here. Um, I also have um, test database. This is the one I'm currently on. It's the only one I've upgraded to uh, patch level 10. Um, and I'm just, I'm just doing some testing, and I'm going to supply this for everybody to look at once I'm done with that testing. But I'm going to make a copy of it. Um, you can see I have two OEC computers here, and I've made a copy already to use for this testing one. So I'm going to make a copy of it again, and we'll call it a sandbox. And we'll show you how to do that and how to identify 